Following our free educational materials, you learn English in a great way with ease and efficiency. May I come in? Yes, please. How are you doing, sir? Fine, thank you. Are you coming for the interview as a secretary? What's your name? Please allow me to introduce myself. My name is Li Wa. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you, too. Miss Li, please have a seat. I am Peter Smith, the general manager. Tell me about yourself and your past experience. I have worked as an executive secretary for five years, first for trading companies, and now I am working for a trust company. I interact well with peers, clients, administrators and bosses. I thrive on challenge and work well in high-stress environments. How are your typing and shorthand skills? I can type 100 Chinese words a minute and take dictation in English at 150 words a minute. Can you operate computers skillfully? Yes, I can. I have received some special training in computers. Besides I am good at operating common office machines, such as fax machines and duplicating machines. Sometimes we are very busy and need to work overtime. How do you feel about that? That's all right. But could you tell me how often and how many hours I should work overtime? It just depends. If we have important visiting delegations, you have to stay with us. It's not unusual. Mr. Smith, I'd like to ask you a question. Okay, please. What specific duties would I perform if I am hired? Nothing different from a secretary's common responsibilities. However, you know, our company is an international trade-oriented company. Can you handle English papers and write English correspondence? Yes. I specialized in English secretary studies at college and that's one of the main parts of my present job. What are your salary expectations? I really need more information about the job before we start to discuss salary. Maybe you could tell me what is budgeted for the position. The starting monthly salary would be 2,000 yen, with rises after the half year according to your competence. I think it's acceptable and I really like the job. And when can I know the decision? We'll inform you of our final decision by early July. Do you have any other questions? No, thank you for the time. Okay, so let's go over everything one more time. I really want you to get this job. I know, it's an amazing growth opportunity. They're true industry leaders. And it would be so interesting to be part of an organization that is the undisputed leader in business process platform development. So, let's see, you did your research on the company, right? Well, I visited their website and read up on what they do. They're an IT service company that offers comprehensive business solutions for large corporations. They provide services such as ARM development, and they also offer custom-designed applications. So what would your role in the company? Well, the position is for an account manager. That basically means that I would be the link between our and our development team. Sounds good, and so, why do you want to work with them? Well, as I said they're the industry leaders. They have a really great growth strategy, amazing development opportunities for employees, and it seems like they have strong corporate governance. They're all about helping companies grow and unleashing potential. I guess their core values and mission really resonated with me. Oh, 
and they offer six weeks vacation. Stock options and bonuses. I'm totally going to cash in on that. You idiot. Don't say that. Do you want this job, or not? Good evening, sir. Welcome to the Comfort Inn. Hello. I have a reservation, under the name Lee, Leo Lee. M. I'm not sure if we have you down here. How do you spell your last name? It's L-E-E. -E. Oh, right. You're in our system. I was just looking under Lee. So, we've got you down for a business suite for three days. If I could just have your credit card, I'll process your check in while. You mean I have to pay now? Oh no, we just make an impression of your card using our credit card machine. It's in lieu of a deposit. If everything is okay when you check out, we give it back to you then. It's pretty STA. I see. I guess you can tell I don't travel much. Later. Here's your card, sir. You're all checked in. Let me just tell you about a few of our services. We have free breakfast in the lounge from 7 o'clock to 9 o'clock. You call the receptionist to arrange. I was really glad to hear about your promotion. Congratulations. Thanks, Jane. I was really surprised. I mean there were a lot of qualified people out there. Sure. But the work you did was really exceptional. You definitely deserved it. Thanks a lot. You are always responsible and careful. Jane, I appreciate it very much. I expect to see you get nominated pretty soon, too. You've been doing some great work. Thank you. I'll try my best. By the way, when do you take over the new position? Next month. So what are you responsible for? I'm going to manage the whole accounts department. So you must get higher pay than before. Yes, the company will also give me a prize of 1,000 yuan. 1,000 yuan? That's great. So. Okay, I know what you mean. It's my treat. Really? Can I order anything I want? Of course. Let's go. And how would you describe yourself, Miss Dow? What kind of person are you? Well, as I mentioned before, I think I am easygoing. I enjoy working and talking with people and I'm a responsible person. Did you have any difficulty getting along with fellow students or teachers? No, not at all. I'm quite easy going. What's your strong points? Oh, I'm very responsible. I can make fast decisions, and I do not need much supervision. I enjoy completing challenging tasks. What do you dislike most about your job? Probably routine, dull work. Oh, I am much more enthusiastic if I'm given a challenge and responsibility. What kind of relationship do you think should exist between a supervisor and employee? A friendly one. I think an open, friendly, honest relationship should exist. An employee should feel she, he, can go to her, his, boss anytime with any kind of question. Sometimes working with a foreign company can be stressful. Foreigners tend to get excited or angry easily, and they show it. Are you sure you can handle this stress? How do you deal with conflict in your present job? Well, there's a lot of stress in a Chinese company also, although much of it is below the surface. I have confidence in my ability to handle conflict. If I have a problem with a coworker, I do everything I can to work it out directly with that person. If I am unable to work it out, then I ask a supervisor to help out.
If my boss shouts at me, I try not to take it personally. I try my best to understand the stress he is under. It's kind of like being in a family. Often family members say things in the heat of the moment, but don't mean what they say. A company is like a family. It has good times and bad times. How do you feel about overtime work? That's no problem. I know that every company has busy periods. When this happens, I'm ready to put in as much time as necessary to get the job done. What is most important to you in a job? I want to feel that I am making a real contribution to the company. So I would like my boss to trust me with important work. Do you think that you are introverted or extroverted? I'm quite outspoken. I enjoy calling a spade a spade and hate talking in a roundabout way. So I'd call myself outgoing. Under what kind of circumstance will you lose your temper? Seldom. But I hate someone's frequently being late or lazy. Okay. What are your strong points? Hmm. As I mentioned, I can work well under pressure and I enjoy work that challenges me. I think that my English ability is also a strong point. And your weaknesses? I think I sometimes try to be over-organized. So I am learning how to let some things go and concentrate on the most important part of my job. Hi. This is Tom Port. May I speak to Mr. Smith? Mr. Smith is not in his office. I am afraid he will not be back before 3 p.m. Would you care to speak to Mr. Brown who takes all the calls in his absence? No, thanks. Can I leave a message for Mr. Smith? Okay, I'll tell him that you called. How do you understand the organizational structure of a company? The organizational structure is the company's framework of communication and authority. Is it true that just like a human skeleton that defines their shapes, companies have structures that define theirs? Yes, you are right. Good morning, sir. May I help you? Good morning. I have an appointment with Mr. Johnson at 10 o'clock. Excuse me, sir, but are you Mr. Richard of World Trading Company? Yes, that's right. I'm sorry, Mr. Richard. Mr. Johnson is on his way to the office. He had just called and asked you to wait a minute. Well, I'll wait. Would you like something to drink, sir? Do you prefer coffee or tea? Thank you. Coffee, please. Here you are, Mr. Richard. This is the cream and this is the sugar. If there's anything else you'd like, please don't hesitate to tell me. Thank you very much. Excuse me, Mr. Rodriguez? Could I speak with you for a moment? I can't just now, Susan. Could we get together this afternoon? What's it about? Well, I'd like to talk about my new contract with you, if that's all right. Oh, that's right. Is that time of the year, huh? That's fine. How about if we meet at 3.30 this afternoon? Were you engaged in any activities at college? No, I had no interest in the activities in college and I spent most of my spare time reading in the library. What kind of activity would make you get involved? None, I guess. My only passion is on reading. Become our student and get access to effective and free educational materials.